Okay gang, here's an explanation on these flags. Okay, that one, if I get this right here. Okay, that one there is not the Scottish flag. I must admit, when I yesterday said it was, I, I wasn't entirely convinced, and it's not. It's the flag of Tenerife. Looks like an inverted Scottish flag, though, doesn't it? Okay, that one there apparently is the flag of the Canary Islands. That one there is the flag of Spain. That's definitely 100%. That one's there, the flag of the accursed European Union, which hopefully on the 23rd of June we're getting the hell out of. And, and that one there is the flag of Aruna. And look at the state of it. I have to admit, I often, you know, when I see flags in tatters, it does make me think about what the people responsible for those flags think of their own flag. It's awful, isn't it? Anyway, where are we? We are in, okay, oh, we're right in the ocean. You can see that. There's some boats there and yachts and fishing, actually. There's some, uh, some fishing boats come up here and just down there, oh, you see that? I don't even see it. Behind the other side of that red car is a... Um, is where some fishermen are, are selling their fish, which should mean that fish and chips should be cheaper here than than, the, than in England. And so far, they're, they're proven to be about the same price, if not a little more. Which, considering that the stores don't have so far to go to get their fish um, wholesale, then I think it's a bit of a piss take. There you go. Anyway, let me um, go over here. Oh, where are we? We are in. Let me turn around. Okay, uh, Arona. That's like the region or something, and this little kind of town place is called Las Galletas. Can't remember what that means. Anyway, here we go. Okay, here's the beach, which, well, <laughs> doesn't quite look what it uh, like some of these postcards. And that, that bit there's just rocks, isn't it, and pebbles, and not so good. However, there you go, and God knows what these people are doing lying out on the tiny bit of sand immediately to my left. So. Anyway, there you see uh, Tenerife is very volcanic and I, I suppose maybe that's how it was created in the first place. Who knows, which means that one day it might uncreate and disappear back into the ocean. But I suppose they'll say that the volcanoes are dormant and, and all the rest of it. But anyway, so it is volcanic. J just walking around you, um, here and there you see that, that sort of black rock that looks as though um, once upon a time it had been inside a volcano and you know, during an eruption it kind of got ejected out and, and is now cooled down and, and there's a lot of it around actually, a lot of it around. Um, anyway, and Sp Spain's highest point is, uh, I don't know, it's probably there I guess, under that cloud. It's normally the way these things work. Um, yeah, and the clouds look a little ominous. It is sort of warm, but I suppose it, it might be raining there I suppose. But anyway, um, here we go. So anyway, so that's the, the flags explained to you. Well done, Matthews. And uh, what else needs explaining? Nothing. Bye.